Hello friends, this video is specifically on diamond pattern program as that is the most asked program in exams and interviews. I'm assuming you have already gone through my previous video on patterns and do know the basic trick we used. We learned that we can make complex shapes by using only two basic shapes, increasing triangle and decreasing triangle. We can make any complex triangular pattern by just breaking it down to these two basic shapes. So if we see the diamond pattern, we have six triangles here. On the top, we have a decreasing triangle of space followed by two increasing triangles of star. On the bottom side, we have an increasing triangle of space and then again two decreasing triangles of star. So let's start with the top half. We first write the outer loop which runs from 1 to n as there is no change in number of rows. Then we bring in one j loop for a decreasing triangle of space, then two increasing triangles of star. Don't forget to put the empty println as the last statement. When we run it, you see we get the two triangles but we do not get the peak. There is actually one extra column in the center. We want to get rid of one of these two columns so the only change we need to do is remove equal to from the for loop of the first star triangle so that it prints one less column. Now when you run it, it's displayed correctly. Now let's make the bottom half. Again we will write the outer loop which also runs from 1 to n. We will first add an increasing triangle of space followed by two decreasing triangles of stars. We also put the empty println as the last statement. Here too you will notice I have removed the extra columns of star so that we can get the pointed peak. Now when you run it, you will see that it's still not perfect as there are two rows in the center so we do not have a side pointy corners. We need to remove one row now. So we will just remove the equal sign of the outer for loop which manages the rows to print one less row. This will give us our diamond pattern. If you still have any doubts, do reach out to us at simplycoding.in or you can join us for our online classes as well. Thank you and all the best.